What's up Ram Scott and welcome back. So for today we have yet another Mortal Kombat 11 video and for today's video we have some pretty crazy news by Ed Boon himself. But before we get into any of that, be sure to smash that subscribe button if you haven't already. So with that being said, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so I'm sure almost all of you know by now, but just yesterday, Ed Boon went on Twitter and basically confirmed that we're getting some type of reveal this week. So this is a tweet right here and as you can see it says, after 8 million and counting MK11 games sold, we're not done yet. Stay tuned to see what's next for MK11 this week. Hashtag combat continues. So right there he just confirmed that we're getting some type of news or reveal this week. And if you've seen this video of mine, then you know why more than likely it's on October 8th, which is in two days. Now the question is, what are we gonna get revealed to us? Well, I kinda narrowed it down to three possibilities. So the first possibility, which would be the worst case scenario, is that we just get some some like confirmation from NRS saying, yes guys, there's going to be another combat pack or there's going to be more DLC characters coming to the game. And the reason why that would be the worst is because we already know this. What we want to see is the actual characters and what they look like. So the first possibility is that, just like a confirmation from NRS, yes guys, there's more characters coming. Which, don't get me wrong, is good, but we just want to see them at this point. Now the second possibility, which is probably the most likely one, is that we get an Aftermath-like trailer with Rambo, Rain, and Melina, as well as a story expansion since that's been in a lot of leaks. And like I said, that would be a pretty good one, definitely getting some type of reveal for Rambo, Rain, and Melina, that would be awesome, as well as some type of update for the game, maybe a new Crypt trailer, I don't know. And then the third possibility, which would be best case scenario, but unlikely, is a full-on combat pack reveal, just like the first combat pack showing us five or six new characters coming to the game. Now you can already imagine why that one is not likely, but it would be awesome if it were to happen. So yeah guys, that's what I think is going to be revealed this week, and if you think that the news coming this week is something other than the reveal, then you are so wrong, because if you guys don't know, the MK11 community has been pressuring NRS and Dead Boon to give us characters for months now, so for sure it is some type of combat pack or character reveals. But anyway guys, let me know what you think is going to be revealed this week in the comment section down below. And with that being said, let's get to the comments of the day. So first up we have, Mortal Kombat Anniversary is the 8th too. So hopefully, you see, that's another reason why more than likely we are getting some type of reveal on the 8th. Next up we have, watch us wait next year to get the next 5 DLC. I'm pretty sure we will. So if you guys don't know, after Rambo, Rain, and Melina, there's 5 more characters coming to the game. But we have no clue who they are. And by the time we get them, it probably will be next year. If you want to know more about that, just check out yesterday's video called The Next 5 DLC Characters. And lastly we have, why are you giving MK11 news with Injustice 2 in the background? Isn't it obvious man? Because Injustice 2 is easily my favorite game ever. It is just so good, especially for a huge DC fan like myself. But anyway guys, let me know all your thoughts on this in the comment section down below. Other than that, be sure to stay subscribed for more videos just like this one. Thank you for watching and peace.